Welcome back to the new features video series for Cubase 7. In this chapter, we'll look at the new kits for Groove Agent 1, as well as new patterns in Beat Designer and new MIDI loops, courtesy of US producer Alan Morgan. Let's start by creating an instance of Groove Agent 1 using the project Add Track Instrument Menus, then selecting Groove Agent 1, and click Add Track. Now we can begin to explore the various kits. Click on the preset window to open the browser. You can see two libraries in the location tree. The library called Groove Agent 1 contains all of the available content, and the library called Alan Morgan Signature Drums contains the new material. If we click on this second choice, you can see the number 30 appear in the corner of the results pane. This means that you're now seeing the 30 new kits that come with Cubase 7. If you look closely at the style column, you can see that there are 9 dance kits, 5 pop kits, 10 rock and metal, and 6 kits for urban or hip hop. But take a closer look at the results pane, and you can see that each is named for the musical style it represents. Single click on the drum kit that you want. The sounds load automatically, and the browser disappears. But if you click on the preset window again, the browser comes back exactly as you left it. Click the pads to hear the samples. The higher up on a pad you click, the louder the velocity. You can rename pads, and you can right-click on their MIDI assignments to change it. And of course, you can mute and solo too. And don't forget there are four tabs in the pad edit area to fine-tune the setup of every pad. This can include setting up mute groups using the voice tab, so that one pad automatically mutes another. The most common use for this is setting up the closed hi-hat pad to mute the open hi-hat pad just like the real instrument. In order to generate a rhythm, let's call up the MIDI insert beat designer and load up one of the corresponding patterns for this kit. If you want to load up Groove Agent 1 and the patterns in one shot, open Media Bay. Then navigate to the VST sound folder. This is the folder where Cubase automatically places all the factory content when you install the program. Now navigate down to the filter called Instrument Set Alan Morgan Signature Drums. Here are hundreds of brilliant MIDI loops and VST presets for almost any modern musical genre. You can preview any of these examples by selecting them. And when you find one that you like, all you have to do is double click it to bring it into your project. Cubase automatically generates an instance of Groove Agent 1. Adds the MIDI notes to the track and even sets up the insert effects and EQ. Groove Agent 1 and all of the effects and EQs are configured. So you can click and drag additional patterns from the same construction kit right onto your track. <laughs> 